contestant, Toastmaster Rodel. Title of his speech, The Roadblock. The Roadblock, Toastmaster Rodel. Contest Chair, fellow Toastmasters and guests, let me ask you this. In your life, have you ever tried driving so fast? So fast that you think you are strong, powerful, and capable of breaking any boundaries. You are confidently going towards your goal until suddenly you hit a roadblock. An unexpected roadblock that you need to press your brakes so hard, but it was too late. In the next moment, you are such in an unbearable pain that you feel like you don't want to go on anymore. I recently felt like that when I lost my mother. My whole life came to a total standstill, like as if I hit a roadblock. These powerful young men, capable of breaking any boundaries, is brought to a complete stop. For the dreams that we had once dreamt is no longer dreamt anymore. The secrets, the secrets that we had is left to me all alone. The bond that we had is broken. My confidant, my teacher, my friend, and most of all, my mother, the person who I love most and the person who gave me life is dead. Her whole life flashed and played off right before my eyes. How she used to endure all the hardships just to make sure that we will be better individuals. How we used to fight against her will for us, but she would always have her way. And like all mothers, she has protected and empowered us with wisdom. On those days that we failed on most of our endeavors, and then, I thought of her smile, her laughter, how, we, how she was proud of what we had become, gathering wonderful moments of her is giving me solace. A smile to my face, but tears to my eyes. I know I have to embrace this and respect the circle of life. I need to respect the circle of life because that is what really have to be. Loving her is food to my soul and I'm sure I'm constantly nourished. That is why I feel that pain is inevitable, but suffering, suffering is optional. Life of a, death of a loved one is just probably be one of our roadblocks in life that we cannot avoid. <coughs> and the thought of it, it's unimaginable. Michael Jordan, who tragically lost his father, he once said that whenever there is a roadblock, you don't really have to stop. But instead, you need to find a way to get over it or probably turn around it and best go through it. Ladies and gentlemen, 
it doesn't really matter at which speed you have come to your roadblock. I am not sure what kind of roadblock you are currently facing. What kind of roadblock you are facing at this time. Or what roadblock you had in the past. What matters most is that every time you are facing it, you would just have to deal with it. Constrict.